Hello and welcome to my quarry chimps guide. I'm gonna be showing you how to beat quarry on chimps today. So first thing you want to do, make sure you have Quincy equipped and then go into quarry obviously. First thing you want to do is place Quincy um, somewhere over here as close to the left as you can without occupying the space that we will need for attack Juju. Okay, once you're done with that and you have placed down both tech shooters, make sure to upgrade the upper tech shooter to 302. So you can take care of all the lads. Okay. Once you've upgraded the tech shooter, next thing you want to be doing is getting three snipers up here while leaving enough space to be able to fit a village over here. So something like... This should be sufficient. Next thing you want to be doing when you've placed all three snipers is upgrade two of them on the top path once and set one of the two that you upgrade to be strong. Third sniper gets the night vision goggles upgrade and the shrapnel shot upgrade. After you're done with that, make sure to get the bottom path twice for all sniper monkeys. Next thing you want to be doing once you're done with the bottom path upgrades on the snipers is village them. So place down a village over here. And make sure to upgrade the village twice on the top path. Once you're done with that, the next thing you want to be doing is upgrading the bottom tag shooter because he is actually the true star of the show when it comes to this run. Upgrade him to 203 and once you're done with that you want to place down a village down here. What you want to do with the village is place it so that all three are in range if possible. If not that's also okay because you're going to upgrade the village jungle drums anyways. But once you're done with the village upgrade, you want to be going for the bottom tech upgrade, which is the overdrive upgrade. And once you're done with that, the village, it's a radar scanner. And after that, we need two alchemists for our bottom tech shooter. And only our bottom tech shooter. They have to be in village range, but not be in the range of these guys. Something like this is perfect. So these two alchemists, ideally you want to upgrade them to three two O's. And after you're done with that, just make sure to upgrade them both to tier 4 on the top path. Incoming. After you're done with that, you want to be going for the middle path Headshot. sniper and upgrade that to tier 5. Once you've upgraded the sniper monkey to elite sniper, you want to upgrade this tag shooter, the upper tag shooter, to the ring of fire. Once 
once you get the ring of fire up here the next thing you want to be going for is the tax zone for the bottom tax shooter and also upgrade your monkey village to tier 4 once you got the tax zone next thing you want to be doing is upgrading the monkey that you only set to first give him large caliber and give him tier 5 bottom path okay once you got the elite defender upgrade you're pretty safe and it's over you're going to win but you can also place down some additional snipers into the tower range up here upgrade uh, the village range upgrade the village and the all too strong give them the stun top path great yeah we'll speed up things a little bit and make sure that DDTs don't do anything they're not supposed to do if you can click the snipers anyways EDTs have no chance against your snipers. Later onwards, when the bunch of the EDT spam comes, uh, you want to have stun snipers to guarantee that nothing funky happens. You don't have to use them, but you know it's, it's always nice to have guarantee that nothing will go wrong. And always make sure to use Quincy's abilities in the late game. Just speeds up things a bit and also makes sure that you definitely don't die. Yeah, the pops on the tag shooter are just ridiculous. Once you get it going, it's basically a spike factory. So, here's the bat. We all know how this ends. If you did um, enjoy this video and found it helpful in any way, make sure to leave a like, please. Subscribe. No, I'm kidding. You don't have to, but it would be nice. I'm glad I could help you. So, stay tuned for the next video, where I'll probably be defeating another map, gyms, and showing you how to do it properly without all of the headaches, trying it yourself.